Hello everyone. Well, hello. Uh, I didn't realize my mic was muted. Hello everyone. This is Chevy Girl for Life. I am here to do a video on how to make money on Red Dead Redemption uh, starting out. But of course, you know, I'm I haven't just started out on a rank 425 or something. I have to look at it. It's been a while since I've logged in. But um, I'm going to show you how to make money. Uh, it's a slow process with this game. Like every game, it's, it's uh, uh, it takes a little while to earn money. So if you any, anybody like that's impatient, like Arthur Rowe, I tell you what, you're not going to have patience for this game. <clears throat> it's a slow process to earn money. Just a sec. Okay. And doing daily challenges, you earn gold. Uh, earn gold and uh, you get ranked up. So you try to do as many daily challenges as you can uh, right off the start. See, daily challenges right off the start. You'll have a uh, general. Um, uh, that's about it. Uh, right, right when you start off, it'll be uh, only general daily challenges, but you try to do all of them. And uh, get get gold with me I mean I really don't do the daily challenges uh, but if you're looking for getting gold daily challenges is a good place to start see th th these are uh, these are able to be done cooked cooked seasoned plump bird I don't know if I have any plump bird let me see I think I do have a plump bird. Give me that. No, I don't have plump bird. Plump bird comes from, uh, I believe it comes from geese, uh, chickens, turkeys, um, different stuff like that. I don't have that, so. Another thing that you need to do with your horse, you gotta make sure you have carrots, uh, all you know, like oat cakes and carrots and you know all vegetables and stuff like apples, fruit. Uh, you gotta make sure your horse is fed so he can uh, work up, uh, be able to stay strong for you. Um, one one good horse. Uh, this one is an Arabian. He's he's a good horse, but he's he's expensive. But he don't. I think he don't open up until like rank 65. But let me show you. Um, let's go to Valentine. Of course, I'm going to Valentine uh, to the stables and show what beginner people get to have open to them when they first start. But of course, you know I'm a uh, I'm a rank 425, but Come here. I'm far from being no, a beginner. <clears throat> but you got to make sure that you have a brush right here. And then, like, carrots and apples and stuff. <clears throat> Let's 
see. Thoroughbred is a really good horse to have. I don't know if it opens right at the beginning. The multi horse uh, Mustangs, they're really good horses. Um, they have pretty good stamina and is able to run and stuff. As long as you feed them, keep them clean, you're good. <clears throat> A no folk roaster is a good horse. Uh, when you get all this, get it, uh, you get leveled up and stuff. This is a good horse to have too. And these horses are good for bounty hunting. They have different categories and what horses uh, you use. This one's pretty good. He does spook easy though. Uh, they're good horses. The Creelo is fast when you get it open. He's a pretty good, uh, he has nice stamina and stuff. The Turkomon is good. I think you can open these, buy these, but they're expensive. But they're, they're a really nice horse if it's open to you. The Fox Trotter is pretty good too. They spook, though. They, you know, it's not a really good horse to be able to go into scary areas like having a panther going out for you. Uh, the horse will kick you off or any kind of uh, alligator. So, <clears throat> let me show you my horses. You see, this is the uh, no fur coaster, dappled buckskin. That's a good horse. Bigger boy is a black Arabian. Farthead is a uh, Britain. They're good at uh, doing uh, bounties. Oh no, this is the Arabian. I'm sorry. Bigger boy is a Turkoman. Use a dick laughing is a uh, uh, Missouri Fox Trotter. Popsico is a Mustang. Of course, I need to add saddle to him. Use a Dick 2 is a thoroughbred uh, black chestnut. You have to have the special edition of uh, Red Dead Redemption to have him. And you do it laughing as another white Arabian. Uh, this is a um, Turkoman. Third bucket, say, uh, uh, Carrillo is a good horse. So, yeah, those are all my horses. I sell one every once in a while and get a different butt to look at. But anytime you, that you're in the stables, <clears throat> make sure that you buy vegetables and stuff. And the horse that you ride on, make sure. I see. I think I'm going to change to him. Do services. There we go. Hello, hello, I'm friendly. Don't want no troubles. Oh shit. Don't want no troubles. I'm not gonna shoot you, dude. Don't worry about it. I'm just getting away from the shooting. But the thoroughbred horses are really good to have. They have a lot of stamina and they're really good. Of course, you know, of course, you buy uh, ammo out of the catalog and you pick it up here. Oh, there's something vibrating here. It's a card. And of course, you pick those up. If you find your, your controller vibrating, 
or anything and you hear that noise, that means that there's something for Nad Madame Nazar. And when you actually open Madame Nazar up and do that, you can sell it. You can make a lot of money on, uh, you make a lot of money doing that. But with people around here, I don't think I want to do a mission here. Let's see. Alright, I don't think I want to do a mission here because there's a couple people here. <clears throat> but anyway. Oh, when I was talking about Arthur is uh try to join anybody's posse and ask if you can help them in any cells or anything. Be nice. Uh if you do camp that's all the way full, you'll get three hundred and twelve dollars if you help them. Uh, right but the moonshine you can make like 30 to 40 bucks yeah, that's some money but you gotta you gotta ask around posse see now not yeah there's nobody that's showing as posse members I don't know if it's the game or not, but usually this is where you find, you know, other posses lined up. But anybody that you can get into, or you can talk to anybody that's in a posse. Hey, do you need help? You know, I'm, I'm a new noob, and I need some money. And I'm sure, see like this, just chilling 24 posse. Uh, it would be in white if you could join it, and you can ask them. They need help. And I'm probably thinking that's the one that's right next to me too. And then <clears throat> if you do that, then you can get friends. And I think they left. But anyway. <clears throat> Uh, another thing you can do is do uh, go into quick join. You can join that and start a mission there. I mean, when you start out, you have missions that pops up all the way around the map. You can actually do those missions first. But after you finish them, you can quick join with somebody. At least that's quicker than actual uh, trying to join and redo the ones that you have. And again, I'm sorry I sound like this. I have a sore throat. But I enjoy doing YouTube videos, so I really don't want to stop doing them. <clears throat> Get over here with that. Stop. Oh, that looks cool as hell. I mean, I can't show you how uh, have the the missions shown up on the thing because I'm way past that. But they're yellow little circles. Um, the storyline, you have to go do them. But with the regular missions, you can earn money and gold. Let's see if I can join without watching the paint dry on my walls.
But you gotta take care of your horse so he can keep going for you. Come on, ready up, let's go. two birds with one stone. If we take out the ammunition dump in the place, then there ain't no way they can blow a hole in the bank they were planning on robbing, which leaves us to do it and have to figure it away. Here's some dynamite to do the job. And if one of you gets the opportunity to kill my so-called lifelong best friend and business partner, I best stay here. I don't want them to know I'm behind this. But, you know, missions help you rank up real good. And make money and uh, make gold at the same time. An eye for an eye, a tooth for a tooth, a knife in the back for a knife in the back. Nice world, Mr. Finch. We are what we are. What we are is a pathetic old man. So it goes. But remember, you don't have to be like this. There's more than one way to earn a buck. Oh, and I saw your friend Horton. He said to say thank you for attending to his business. Said you'd understand. Not sure I do. Like I said, good luck. I'll watch how you get on. Hmm. All right. Come here and use a dick. No, this ain't my horse. Sorry, dude. Get on my horse. Okay, let's uh, go for that.
I'm out of ammo. Oh, okay. I feel dumb. Thank you very much. Here's some cash to keep you going. That bastard's death makes my life much easier. Now we won't have the army going after the same banks as we are. We can never get the planning up. I'll be in touch if I can. And I'll be in Blackwater! <laughs> and your bounty will be in any sheriff's office. I said away with you, old bastard. Ah, oh, you'll hear me in your sleep, bitch. <laughs> All right, I know it's going to be tedious, uh, constantly running missions over and over and over again. But you got to earn money. He earned a little bit of gold and probably about 20 bucks on each mission. Oh, my moonshine's done. That's another thing you got to work for to get some money. The price is on moonshine is about uh, 140 to about 270, I think. It depends on what kind of moonshine you have. What do I have here? I don't have a bounty on. <coughs> Alrighty.
If you have any, uh, if you want to run your missions again, you go under progress. Story missions. And here's all the missions that you can run, but at the beginning you'll have to run all these. And there are high, uh, high, uh, high and low, uh, oh god, I didn't think of it. High and low, uh, bounties. Or, high and, <laughs> god, uh, there's high and low honor missions. I think there's like four high, then four low. You have to be a pretty low, uh, honor to run the other four but once you beat them all once you do them you can just redo them no matter what honor you are so oh and another thing uh, I forgot to mention the awards you won't have these three at first but, uh, you'll have the, uh, combat, sharpshooter, hunting, survivalist, crimes, travel, trade, general, horse, posse, free roam, and competitive. And see, with the horses, uh, achieve the maximum bond level on a horse, and that will give you, uh, point four in gold. Uh, that's another way to earn gold in this game. But you gotta, uh, free roam. I mean, I haven't done all of them. Like, free roam, get 10, uh, complete, ten, free, t uh, free roam emissions from 10 characters. Um, you get four point four in gold. Um, there are things like, uh, clear hideouts. Uh, if you get a hundred, you can do ten of them, uh, and you get up to a hundred clear, you'll get, uh, some gold, and then you re reset it, and you start all over, and as soon as you hit a hundred, you'll get some more gold, but the, on the furthest that you can do that is ten times, so it's... <laughs> You earn gold on that. <coughs> That's another way to earn gold. Ma'am, it's a pleasure to have you back with us. You are quickly becoming you do a free roam mission. And you get different uh different missions you could do. Let's do the delivery because it's easiest. Just post bags. Just go take a look around the back. And any bag you find, you take it where it's going. Not particularly glamorous, but someone's got to be paid for it. And may as well. Yazamini. Hey, laughing. I'm not a meanie on this game. Oh, there it is. So you do these missions, you get gold and money. And make sure you feed your horse and keep him clean. To keep his stamina. You need to give your voice a rest. Oh, no way. I like doing uh, YouTube. It's the only time I use it, so... We got guys going. And also with the uh <clears throat> you make sure that you uh 
Loot them. Because you don't know what you're going to get. You can get something from Madame Nazar. You can earn money and stuff. Looting people earns you a lot of money, too. You can get cards, uh, rings, uh, jewelry, uh, different stuff you can sell to the fence. Uh, they did fix that to a point where uh, you can earn more money on it. But um, <clears throat> with these missions, some people wait until like four minutes until the mission is close to over. But if you wait until after four, you get more money, more gold. But, you know, I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to go ahead and turn it in. Hey, you're going to look like laughing. No, you have more hair. Sorry. <laughs> Whoops. See, I can't give it to him. The game's glitching out. Game's glitching out. Damn it. See who's a meanie LOL. Um, yeah, I'm a meanie. Probably would have been better if I would have put my weapon up. I didn't even think about that. Appreciate. You get eight gold, one thirty-six XP, and six He's bucks. Yep, yeah, I am. I'm always a meanie. Not meanie in this game. I see nobody's in here. That guy's poor. He's a low rank. Uh, let's see. <clears throat> the other way you can earn money on here is picking herbs. You push L3 and R3 on the PlayStation. I don't know what you do on the Xbox, but on the PlayStation. You see the little white things glowing. See, you push square to pick it up, but I'm already full. I'm full on carrots, too. Dang it! It's all laughing's fault. Okay. There's something. Liked and shared. Thanks. Have I appreciate it. Fine, sir. No, I was just trying to tell Arthur how to make money on here, but he never stuck around long enough to wait. Oh, those are horses, aren't they? 
can't kill those. Okay, let's go to a share. Uh, if well, his loss. Yeah. Like I said, screw it. <clears throat> he wanted me to do it yesterday, but I wanted to get done with GTA. But he got mad at me for it. I think I've already been around here. Oh. Alright. Asterisk oh well. <laughs> oh, maybe he'll watch it, no. I think he'll just cool down and be back. Cause I just see, I see Arthur doing that, being mad and all that, and I think he's gonna not be mad anymore. But no, I'm not gonna try to help him anymore. Is my gun dirty? No, it's not that bad. Hello, dude. I'm friendly, man. Please don't shoot me. Hello? Hey! I didn't do anything to you, buddy. Fucking... Oh, sorry. Plus charges. People like that you try to stay away from. That's what I do. I don't understand why people like that do that because what's the point? There's no, there's no, uh, oh, you got no, leave me alone, dude. Go get the oppressor. I wish. But I, I really don't retaliate in this game because I kind of suck on fighting people. And I don't have no fire ammo, so check it shit. Fifty one. Okay, buddy. There you go. Disruptive behavior. I mean I don't do anything to anybody and I usually don't do anything to anybody in this game. He probably saw my rank and said, let's get out of here. That's when I like to have my fire ammo and go after him. But I'm out of it. Oh, and another thing, <clears throat> when you first start out, uh, you shoot a bunch of animals. Yes, I have. I've been cheating on them. You can sell meat, you can sell anything on here, earn some money. But since I own a camp with a, a trader role, I save all my uh, well, my tusk and all that. Can't really do anything with that. But with your meat, I can sell all of it because I've cooked everything to fill my inventory up. So you can sell your meat. See, you earn four dollars for that. In the time, you'll know how to. Uh, oh, there's something vibrating. Let's see. There you go. That's the reason why he was able to lasso me. Let's see, there's some something vibrating in here. There it is. Right to it. Again, you can sell these to Nazar and get a bunch of money. Oh, there's something else in here, too. No, 
No, it's got to be upstairs. But this is the reason. This is the reason why I love this game. You know, this old wash basin. My grandmother she owned one a long time ago. And this game brings me back to it. The brass bed and the uh, different furniture in here. God, I miss my grandmother. Rest in peace, Granny. But I miss her so much. She was the rock that kept my family together. Okay, enough of that. Okay, where am I vibrating from? <clears throat> oh, it's, oh, there it is. We got the comb. But if anything that vibrates around you, look for it and you can pick it up and when you get uh, the uh, Madame Nazar stuff, you can sell it. You make if you collect enough, you get three or four thousand dollars just in that. If you spend all day looking for them, and you can earn. I am a meanie. But you, if you collect that all day, then you can earn like thousands and thousands of dollars. And they have maps online to show you exactly where all this stuff is hidden. But you gotta have uh, be able to uh, have the uh, Nazar thing open. <clears throat> but you can still collect them and then, but, and then, you know, kill animals and sell them to the butcher. And you can also do bounties. But I'm gonna sell my my stuff to the doctor. That's another way you can earn money. See, I got a lot of stuff. Uh, if you're starting out, I would keep ginseng on you. If just in case you get bit by a snake or a poisonous snake, you just take one and gets rid of it. Uh, you want to season your meat, uh, mint, um, oregano, um, uh, thyme is another one. But you can sell this stuff. I really don't have no use for it. You sell that. Damn, I have a lot of stuff mm. saved up. Sure. All right. I'll take it. But uh, when you get the uh, pamphlet of uh, making horse meal, um, I think it's like mushroom, uh, currant, and hay. It'll get out. I gotta look at it again. I'll, I'll look at it under my pamphlet. Get out. But uh, if you own a moonshine, when you get that worked up, you can uh, uh, make the berries. No winter green berry. Uh, you can make moonshine recipes, but that's that's far away until you get that stuff done. The golden current current is another thing that you can make uh, stuff with uh, raspberry or blackberry. You got to keep the carrots for your horse. You can use uh, tobacco uh, for different ammo and medical purposes, but I don't use those because I don't get in a fight. I tried to avoid it like there was a plague on this game. Uh, early in or sage, it will be, uh, can be used in para uh, poisonous arrows and all that. But, you know, again, uh, I really don't use arrows. But you can sell stuff in here. But anyway. <clears throat> Let's see if I can do a bounty. Okay, let's see. You can pick one. Uh, you know, the, the more money signs, of course, the more money it is. But we're going to do an easy one since it's by myself.
But bounties are, uh, when uh, you do them, if you bring them back to life, bring them back alive, uh, you get more money. But you can return them if they're dead, but you don't get as much money. And I think the bounties are the same way as regular missions. If you wait for the longest to turn them in, you get more money and gold and RP. I don't know why that is. I think they should have, uh, instead of the shorter time you keep it and the quicker you do it, the more money you should get. But, you know, Rockstar Logic. Let me make sure. Yep, got my reinforced lasso. But, you know, that's going to take a while. But, you know, if anybody... Oops! But anybody that you can... Uh, you can volunteer to help them. Come on, horse! Get up! But if anybody that you can help with, you know, be nice and ask if they need any help. People always need help. Oh my god, is this the same guy? Hey Chevy. Hey Chrissy. Hey Nipple. <laughs> Ariel. Oh. Damn, this is a far away. Pocket. Mary, leave them alone, sweetie. Oh, damn, I'm surprised I made that. Shut it. And of course, you know, with this game, I mean, you. The bolt action is one of the best guns, in my opinion. Oh, boy. Oh, he's on top. Get out of there, Ariel! Quit! You don't need any fragrance spray. Did you get your step ladder? Where am I going? Yes, low face with tears of joy. Again, try to uh, loot 
anybody. Of course, they sped this up. Of course, you got to look for the uh, get the uh, reinforced lasso because uh, people can break from it. Hey, let me go. My horse is twerking. Chuck. Look at my horse. Chuckles. Chuck. Oh, you see it? Oh, you're watching. Oh, man. <laughs> what in Yeah, it's funny though, the horse doing that. Oh! Somebody do something! Of course, this is the same thing as uh, doing the missions. The longer you wait, the more money you get, but I'm not going to do that. You can wait until like under 30 seconds when it turns red, and you'll get a lot of money for it. As if you got the time for it. BRB. All righty. God, please help me. Get down. I need coffee. <laughs> Get down. You know, same here. I think I got some of that. Uh, that premix. Oh, God, he's mean, isn't he? New update out for GT7. Oh, there's some good money there. Alrighty. <clears throat> Another thing. Let's see. I'm going to go to San Denis. They saw how pissed people were for nerfing payouts and gave everyone one million dollars. Cool. <coughs> I wish GTA would do something. Or uh, Red Dead Red I'm not. GTA 5, I wish Rockstar would do something about that. How pissed off everybody is. But Rockstar doesn't give a shit. <laughs> There's a, a crew invite. Let's see. 
See what he's got. You need help, dude? You need you need help with cells or missions or anything? I'm Chevy girl for life. I wanted to see if she, if she needed help. I like doing missions and stuff. Get out there. LOL, one million dollars won't help you in GTA. Yeah, I know. Too bad. <laughs> I'm here. See, what is this guy doing? Oh, wait a minute. I love the sound of the way the horse is sounding. See, where are you at, dude? Oh, he's all the way in Valentine. All right. Well, let's go over here. I didn't feel that. I know you you felt it, use a dick. Another good thing is, uh, see if there's any alligators over here. <coughs> there's no alligators. shot him right in the head. You get make a lot of money on uh, alligators too. I need fat. But of course, you know if the guys, the people that you join are not doing anything, then face with tears of joy. you can leave and try to find another posse that's doing stuff. Oh man, I'm nowhere near them. See, see they're making a cell. Their, their delivery's right close to me. Oh, it's right here. Where are these guys at? Oh, they're way down there.
I'm gonna check over here and make sure that there's nobody over here. No, it looks like just a regular drop off. So they're probably being attacked. Well, of course, you know, I'm going to go over there and try to help him. Of course, kill everything and collect everything. to their camp to help them out. That's the way I always do and help. And that's how you make good friends. It's helping people out. I knew that they would be attacked. And make sure you thank them from hiring you for uh, for helping you. Sorry. Ooh. My horsey almost went into the tree. Thank you for the money. I appreciate it. Do y'all need any help with anything else? I like doing missions. Seems like and I'm not a meanie in this game. I'm actually pretty nice. Excuse me.
You gotta have fat for explosion ammo. Tell you what, them trees always pop out of nowhere. So you can spray me in the face. <coughs> oh, there's something there. Okay, I don't even know where y'all are going. <coughs> oh, all right. I'm even sounding some moonshine. boss we'll be running this whole state within the year Oh, no, sorry, I had it on mute. That's how you do interaction. You go to the, the state, go, tr push the triangle all the way up, and then push circle real quick, and that'll give you a drunken player uh, interaction. You just do it twice, and you're able to get gold. And that's a daily challenge. I haven't done these in a while. Looks like this is a mission, like a, a story mission. Yeah. <coughs> Let's see what we...
found it. No, maybe not. Dang, I need to get some ammo. I'll come back to get you, my piggy. Oh, now Chevy, check your PS messages. All right, I will. Come on, horse. Let me off you. Thanks, dude.
Oh, shoot. Somebody revive me, please. Can you please revive me, please? Thanks. Send it to you to Chrissy. I can't put one on there. That mission took a while. Chow, do you spell cake? LOL. Asterisk how? So we good now? Excellent. Just had a clear enough message. So you've earned yourself a drink. 
thought I'd find you here. What the hell you think you're playing at? It's all right. That was a real dumb move. I don't know what you're talking about. I thought I warned you. You know, all them years, I never realized just how much a coward you really are. Who the hell, Maggie? Well, I already have. Let me tell you. You really like it. Single damn about you. I mean, who's this sap? Bartholomew Breakwhite. Yeah, I know who you are. Oh, your family's running right moonshine now, huh? You're finished. Stay finished. I swear next time you'll burn for good. Uh, next time you should send someone more intimidating. Don't you worry about that. Come on. <coughs> Mm. It's 16 bucks for that. An RP and some gold. some ammo I love my ammo I usually use. Sent to me. <coughs> and where? Yeah, I didn't see it. Messages. Yeah, I'll check that when I get uh, done here. Low face with tears of joy, that's great. Chevy, it's in good name for a party. All right. Yes, there is a problem. There's always a problem here. Some more fat. Get some fat. Press the letter to spell 
always kill animals because you can always sell their feathers or use them in certain recipes. <coughs> uh oh. There's always something wrong with me. But of course, you could always go to uh, go here at night. They won't call the cops on you, but you can get uh, cow skins and sheep skins, sheep meat. But I'm not going to kill any animals because it's during the day and the cops come after you. But this is where you come and sell your jewelry. You make some pretty good profit on it, but I don't have anything to sell. Yeah, this, I already got everything. But this is where you get your pamphlets to, uh, to fix certain things up. <clears throat> but I already got all of it. Well, back to what I was doing before I was hired. You get fat out of this one too. To move my camp closer to me. But once you get uh, your uh, trailer roll open, you can earn some money. But uh, the one animal I think uh, you can make a lot of money on is uh, white, a uh, white-tailed buck, and then alligators. <coughs> and also every five levels you'll get a treasure map. It depends on... You might get lucky. You get different stuff with it. And I'll do a map real quick.
try this in. Ooh, I'm low on everything. I mean, I would sell all of it, but I have the trader role, so. Well, you could start a resupply mission. You won't get any money from it, but you save money from ordering it, but. You get a little bit of RP. Making some uh, Explosive ammo. <clears throat> I use that on people that try to grief me. That shot is one hit, one hit kill. Makes them horse meal. <clears throat> when you make that, it fills all your horses' cores up. And the Capitella, Capitelli missions are about the same as the regular missions. You get about the same amount of money. Um, oh, I gotta make sure. And also, you gotta make sure that your guns are clean. If your guns are clean, you can get a better shot on animals and more money you can earn. See, it's a little dirty. But you gotta make sure you have uh, oil, keep oil on you. That one's filthy. Almost ranked up. What's that in the mist there? Oh, I think that's a bounty.
Oh, see, I picked up some jewelry. Then you pick up some RP. Dude, where's this puppy going? <clears throat> yeah, I don't think I'm gonna do a video tomorrow. I mean, this doesn't pay much, but it's money. It's money in RP, so. Boy, this is a far away. <clears throat> Annsburg. But these might the missions probably just show up for people that have the bounty uh, bounty license. But still, you know, you can earn money on it if you ask somebody else to help them and stuff. But any anything helps. Also, um, another good thing to have on this game is, you, I think you get ranked up to 14, get a fishing pole. Buy some worms and stuff. And, uh, the most expensive uh, fish is the bass or the uh, the pink salmon. And you can look it up on YouTube. Let's see. Yeah, I think the, the right over here is where the pink salmon is. And over here. All right here, that's another one. Uh, this is Madame Nazar. I ain't even been near her, and that's the collector's role. I hate yeah. fishing in real life. I won't do it in a video game. Sure you will. But anyway, that's Nazar, uh, the collector's role. That, I would highly suggest to get the uh, collector's role because you make a lot of money in that. I could probably sell stuff over there. Let's see where is she next to. 
Wallace Station. And of course, you know Gus. If he, you can always sell stuff to him. He's kind of like the butcher, but uh, he, you can uh, give him pelts, and he can make stuff for you. But his pelts are just way too expensive. But fishing is a good money-making uh, venture in this game. I did in the playthrough of story mode, but only because I had to. Yeah, I miss fishing. I can sit and stare at water while I am sitting comfortably at home. <laughs> See if there's anything over here. Yeah, but you can always go f hunting. <laughs> oh. the rabbit. I'm the rabbit slayer. Kill the rabbit. Too easy to hunt, LOL. Yeah. And a lot of people, you know, they always try to go for the perfect pelts and stuff like that. And they don't take the uh, small stuff. I mean, the low quality stuff. You can still make money off it. I killed everything. I guess I'm being nice because I, I share my ammo with the animals. I mean, Earl, LOL. I always like sharing ammo with the animals. That's. It, Especially on the game. I need to go to my, uh, see? See if we can get an alligator and sell it and show how much money you get on it. <clears throat>
All right, I figured that I was on mute. I'm gonna go ahead and sell this stuff and show how much shit you can get from it. I'm trying to mute it so I won't be coughing in the mic that much. Oh, looks like we're having a shootout. But when you first start out, this the butcher is your best friend. Nikki, how are you doing? Let's see. Uh, for a good alligator skin, it's five dollars. A good one is two seventy, and then a bad one is you know lower. But basically, the butcher is your best friend when you first start out, and. Uh, I don't want okay. it. How are you? Um, Feeling better? No, not really. With the big game meat, you get $15. That's money right there. So, I'm not going to sell everything. So I, I got a, a trader roll that takes most of it. Hide the Cheetos. And another way to make money, and that's every five uh, different ranks, you get a treasure map. Sorry to hear that. Get well soon. Hey, I'm trying. Allowed to be sick. <laughs> that's what laughing always says. Okay. No, not that. Okay, and here's the treasure maps. Uh, you get one every five ranks. Let's see. No, I don't want to do the blue mark water mark. I, I have a lot of them. Yep, Chevy's breaking the rules again. Let's do that one. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Ooh, that's far away. And that's close to Nazar, so. Alright, I'm going to guess uh, go to Strawberry. That's the closest. <laughs> and it's always good to be near a fast travel. So you can fast travel closer to the, the treasure. Because like I said with the treasure map, it's uh, sometimes you get real lucky and get like a hundred and some dollars or uh, some gold and stuff. I'm just trying to, you know, tell people what to do when they first start out. It's not going to, the money is not going to show up in your account, like, real quick unless you buy, uh, buy gold. But it's going to take a little while to earn some money. Let's see if I can come across the Nazar. these guys no. 
Get up here and sit down. But always, you know, any animals that come up to you, freaking kill them for money. And it took me a while to learn this game. And I don't know everything on it either. Oh, be quiet, use a dick. Take you home. No. All right, let's go to. Let's go look for this map. Yeah, and Red Dead Redemption does kind of get competitive, you know. Over and over again, but if you want to earn money, you have to be patient with it and play it a while if you want to get ahead in it. But it's a fun, relaxing game. I really, truly enjoy it. This is a good area to hunt. Yeah, this is a good area. And this here is a great area to hunt. You get a lot of animals because there's like filled of emptiness. You get a lot of animals with it. There we go. That's not supposed to happen. <laughs> Come on, horse. <coughs> okay. Hopefully I can find this. I usually circle around the outskirts and start going inside. You, you. I don't feel no vibrations on the controller. somewhere around here. Okay, well. 
Quit, Ariel. Oh, it's somewhere in this area, somewhere. There it is. <laughs> you know, one gold bar, ninety one dollars and ninety one cents. Uh, definitely, uh, if, when you're first starting out, you gotta do the treasure maps, and you'll get one every five, every five levels. Go to Lazar, or Nazar. Let's see where is she at. All right, over here. Let's see if I got anything to sell. Not covered fishing bounties selling food and selling body parts of animals to the butcher missions and side missions Of course, you know, there's moonshine missions, there's different, different kind. If you don't have the time, if you think that you're going to earn all this money real quick, you're going to be sadly mistaken on this game. Although Rockstar has fixed it to a point where you make a little bit more money. And they added more missions and stuff, so...
There she is. See, you know, when you collect the stuff, when you get the uh, stuff, you can sell it. But, uh, you know, I'm not going to sell it because I'm going to get away from her music because I don't know if that's a copyright claim or not. But that's a good way to make money, too. Let's put my camp over here. Oh, there's something else over here. I don't know where it is. Sounds like it's on top of the tree. Well, of course, I don't want y'all getting bored with it. I'm not really sure where it is, but I may go back to my camp. And putting your camp over here is a pretty good spot. But you see all the animals over here. And um, the other things you can do is hideouts. They have uh, jewelry hidden in there and different stuff. There's usually a hideout that goes on here. But I uh, see. There should be three things in here. But you loot everything like cabinets and stuff. But there's different stuff in here like bullets and uh, tonics and stuff. But any kind of jewelry, you can sell it in the, uh, in the, uh, oh, I can't think of it. I have a brain fart.
In the fence. I hear a bear in the background. But, you know, if you started out, you'd be selling all this stuff to uh, <coughs> the butcher. You make some pretty good money. I suppose this will do. Okay, this will have to do. But when you fill this up, uh, if you if you start a uh, trader roll, uh, when you fill it all up, it's uh, for a close delivery, it's five hundred dollars. If you do a long distance, it's seven fifty. I'd rather do the short distance because there's more of a chance somebody can attack you on the long distance. Well, I'm not full all the way, so. But between collecting animals and, you know, selling them to the butcher and stuff, you can go, I can do missions, and, you know, bounties and stuff with other people. Hey, butt sniffer, what's going on, buddy? Y'all like his name? <laughs> okay. And I was just getting y'all on, uh, you know, a way to make money on this game and get ranked up. Cause one of my old friend that I don't have anymore, Arthur, he was uh, asking how he can make money on Red Dead. And I thought that would be a pretty good idea to do a video on it. Well, I'll probably uh, do a few more missions and then I'm going to get off. <clears throat> no. No, Ariel. But it's just, you know, it's easier just to ask people if they need help or something on sales and tell them that you're, you're new and all that. Waiting on that paint to dry. See, I think since I've been doing, playing this thing, I've earned about $200, $300. No, no, it's in like about two hours. If you grind it and kill animals, you'll probably get a lot more money and, you know. Your Horley's protégés, huh? He sent word you was decent. I hope so. This land is full of scum. Spend most of my time thinking they're better off left to it. Ah, they're good ones. Real good ones. Part of beer cold. Go away, old man. I told you to go away. I'm going, Mr. Marshall. Tom Davis, U.S. Marshal. See? I'm going. Been sent on a trail of a band of killers. I'm still going. This one, uh, Alfredo Montez. Killed a family up near Thieves Landing. It's some unspeakable things. He's wanted in four states and two countries. And I think he's holed up near Manzanita Post. You take a ride with me to take a look? 
Alright then, let's go. Alright then. I gotta get, get my ammo, my normal guns. Okay. Oh yeah, if you love horses, this is the game for you. <clears throat> and one of the most graphic games, I think. Causing a crime or whatever the damn law is. But the thing is, is uh, well, anyway, here's Lee, the fellow we're supposed to meet. Hello, Tom. Uh, friends, how's it going, Lee? Yeah, Montez is wily. You know it and I know it. He knows we're coming, Tom. He's holed up and they're waiting for us. Place is crawling with guards, patrols, everything. It's gonna be tough, you know? Mm. Well, that's what I pay you all for. <laughs> Pay enough nice to do your job. Well, I can't go and kill a man in cold blood, Lee. Not while I don't have the evidence I need. But I can turn a good old-fashioned blind eye to an unfortunate dispute that I did not see. And yeah, but of course, you know, there are PVPs and gunfighting and stuff. Y'all can... Do that for money, that's pretty good money, but I, I'm not that way. I don't like shooting other players, so I just stick with missions, killing animals. No, Ariel. But yeah, there's like uh, horse races. Uh, the horse races don't pay that much. PvP pays pretty good, but I don't do that. There's different things on here that I don't do due to not wanting to shoot anybody.
course they hurt. Always loot. See, I got a ring. I can sell that for like three bucks. I think. Always loot people so you can earn money on that. Yeah, maybe they didn't hear us. Yeah, I know. I don't think, I think they heard us. No. Ariel, get out of there. Get out of there. Get. And make sure you eat meat. Make sure you cook plenty of it. Hold on, dude. I got you. <clears throat> no, Ariel. Bastard's head. Leave that alone, Ariel, please.
Oh, wrong way. I'm surprised I get knocked off my horse on that one. Ariel, get out! Ariel, leave that alone. show folks that we're willing to bring law and order any way we can. Hmm. But this ain't Montez. Hmm? At least it ain't Alfredo Montez. And it's his brother. Ah. Here's some money. Fleet, here's yours. You lot, here's yours. It's less than I promised, but more than nothing. Given that you killed the wrong brother, it's mighty generous to me. Hmm. Now let's be clear. Jorge Montez was a no good son of a bitch with a price on his head. Only in that family was he considered a saint. All right, friend. I'll be seeing you. Maybe up in Van Horn if you have any chance. Hmm. My next lead is that maybe uh, Alfredo Montez will be there. <laughs> Kill the wrong goddamn bastard. Well, I never. Well, these things happen, Lee. In fact, they happen more often than we like to admit. <laughs> oh, dang. That was nasty. Stop. Stop, Ariel, please. Quit. Money and gold. Uh, but anyway, um, <clears throat> you can uh, quit. You can do different stuff, go into different things, whatever, you know, what you like doing. Uh, this one's got triple money, triple RP. Uh, race series you don't make a lot of money on them story missions that's what I usually do so yeah you can also find them on the map
There's the inside story missions there. I don't know if I did that. Yeah, I did one. Uh, these are bounties. There's a uh, elimination series, featured series, shootout series. There's a lot of series and stuff, and uh, different stranger missions and stuff like that. As you can see, there's a lot of ways to make money in this game. I just don't do a lot of them shootout series and stuff. I just, I mostly, I just kill animals, sell them off, uh, trade them into Gus, or trade them into uh, my camp, and he makes material, and I'm able to sell it and stuff. And uh, my moonshine, let's see. Quite the piece of hope for. Maybe I'll never find that. But I can finally blow it. I have finished this batch. We can sell it when you like. Uh. Let's see. 